A Bartlesville teenager who has been through more than most kids his age just published his first children's book. It's an accomplishment Caden Carr hopes will honor his mother. News on 6's Amy Slanchik has his story. Well, hello there. I'm the non-stopping hopping kangaroo, and you'd be amazed by the things I can do. Caden Carr just published oh, his first book. It's already kangaroo. sold more than 100 copies. He's a Bartlesville High School student who takes college but classes at RSU, and he decided not to wait to go after his dreams. I want kids to take away that, um, you know, life is about having fun, and it's too short to, to worry about kind of the silly things. Lots and lots of sketches, things that didn't turn out, resketch, redraw. Quincy Turner, a recent Bartlesville grad and artist, is the illustrator. It was one of the hardest things I've ever done. The two of them spent months working to get the book ready for print. So I redrew them. So this was originally it, and now this is the guy we ended up with. Caden will be signing copies of his book here at the bookstore Moxie on 2nd, coming up on Saturday the 25th from 1030 to 1230. I'm definitely excited for it, and if it's something that people want to see and meet me, then, I mean, that's awesome. I, I love to meet everyone and, and do what I can to, to, you know, just even brighten their day. But Caden wrote this book for bigger reasons than that. And after she died, I kind of promised that I would carry on her legacy. The 17-year-old is emancipated. His mom, Chrissy, died last January. She was a single mom, you know, raising four kids. So she made a lot of sacrifices for us. I didn't want that to be all for nothing. Um, so I decided that I wanted to make her proud. And so... This is the first step. And while the message of the book is about having fun. Oh, I can do that and stand on one foot. Caden hopes people will be inspired by his story to take on life's challenges. In Bartlesville, Amy Slanchik, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.